Good morning, everyone. Um, I'm going to show you a little something. I got a Dollar Tree frame. I uh, did the reverse canvas, which is taking like a box cutter or whatever and cutting on each side of the staples you see. And then you can just take it off. And then I hot glued it back on. I used to re-staple it on, but I seen somebody do the hot glue and I thought that's great. So it's hot glued back on. I painted it. And then I painted the inside blue, and then I did a pair of wings from a silicone mold using ultra light air dry clay. And then I used Mod Podge glitter, extreme glitter, to make a little shine on them. And now we're going to put a um, decal on it that I just cut on my Air 2 machine. I tried it with the joy. It, it just gave me a hard time. So we'll do this first. You take this off. Ta -da. <laughs> Garbage is right here. And then I'm going to take off the little paws. The inside of the paws. We're not going to take the paws off, but let's see. It's very hard to see that little crack. I did download something on an iPad. It was a light app. But for this little demonstration, I thought I'd be able to see it. Of course, my window shade is shut. Okay, now big one and see if the little much better cut than on the joy much better voila now for the e and the a and the transfer tape <laughs> This could be a little tricky too. Oh, try taking it off first. <laughs> okay. And my little scraper. Flip it, scrape it again a little bit, and peel. Okay. If it's where you want it, maybe not. It's very hard once you do that, you know. Mm, I'm not sure where I want it. I think I put the wings up too high. So... Okay. And you scrape it and hope it all comes off where it should be. <laughs> There's times I throw so much vinyl away, it's terrible. And this isn't going to stay down either. That means you got to play with it more. Okay, let's try the back. Sometimes if you can just get the one to stay, the rest will stay. But the name's going to give me a problem. And this is why sometimes I'd rather do, of course you wouldn't get personal stuff, um, the silk screen stenciling with the chalk or ink paste. You don't have this waste. Oh. Some people make it look so easy, don't they? Not me. You're seeing a real McCoy. I have problems. <laughs> I 
I've seen somebody struggle doing a video on just keep scraping, keep scraping. That's kind of the one that one that gave me a hard time before. Oh, we might have it. We just may have it. Whoop. Come on, heart. Stick there. Put this back on, you'll reuse it. And oh, I wanted to put this on or something on it just to give it another press. I know some people even use the iron on on something like this, but I've never had a problem with it coming off. And now We'll use a little glue. Maybe. Let's try it that way. I can't find my little finger things. I don't know where they went. It's to protect your fingers from the glue. Okay. I'll probably go over this again. You can also, some people even put Mod Podge on it. I have not ever. But. That's the project for today. It's on a Dollar Tree frame that I even painted. Did the reverse canvas. Did the, the wings in an ultralight air-dried clay in a silicone mold. Waited a couple days. And then I put the extreme glitter Mod Podge on them to give them that little shine. And... Uh, that's today's little project. I hope you liked it. I had a hard time getting it off, but that's nothing new. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you will hit the like or subscribe if it's on YouTube and you're watching it. And come on back. You never know what we might try to do the next time. And uh, I'm going to rub this a couple more times, make sure it's down. But anyway... God bless. Come on back. Have a good day. Bye-bye.